Stanley took a shower, ate dinner and went to bed. Stanley는 샤워를 하고 저녁을 먹은 뒤 잠자리에 들었습니다. Stanley took a shower, ate dinner and went to bed. Because of the scarcity of water, each camper was only allowed a four-minute shower. 물이 부족하기 때문에 각각의 캠퍼들은 4분 동안만 샤워를 할수 있었습니다. Because of the scarcity of water, each camper was only allowed a four-minute shower. It took Stanley nearly that long to get used to the cold water. 스텔리는 차가운 물에 익숙해지는데 시간이 걸렸습니다. It took Stanley nearly that long to get used to the cold water. He never managed to use his bar of soap because he wouldn't have had time to rinse off the suds. 비누를 쓸 시간이 없었기 때문에 그걸 사용할 수 없었습니다. He never managed to use his bar of soap because he wouldn't have had time to rinse off the suds. Dinner was some kind of stewed meat and vegetables. Everything tasted pretty much the same. 저녁은 뭉근이 끓인 고기와 야채였고 모든 게 거의 같은 맛이 났습니다. Dinner was some kind of stewed meat and vegetables. Everything tasted pretty much the same. He ate it all and used his slice of white bread to mop up the juice. 그는 그릇에 남은 국물까지 빵으로 깨끗이 닦아 모두 먹었습니다. He ate it all and used his slice of white bread to mop up the juice. Stanley had never been one to leave food on his plate, no matter how it tasted. 스텔리는 음식 맛이 어떻든 간에 그의 접시에 음식을 남긴 적이 없습니다. Stanley had never been one to leave food on his plate, no matter how it tasted. What did you do? One of the campers asked him. At first, Stanley didn't know what he meant. 뭘한 거니? 캠퍼 중한 명이 그에게 물었습니다. 처음에 스탠리는 그가 뭐라고 하는지 몰랐습니다. What did you do? One of the campers asked him. At first, Stanley didn't know what he meant. They sent you here for a reason. Oh. He realized. I stole a pair of sneakers. 이유가 있어서 널 여기 보냈겠지. 그는 그제야 깨달았습니다. 운동화를 훔쳤어. They sent you here for a reason. Oh. He realized. I stole a pair of sneakers. From a store? Or were they on someone's feet? Asked Squid. Neither. Stanley answered. 가게에서? 아니면 누가 신고 있던 걸? Squid가 물었습니다. 둘다 아니야. Stanley가 대답했습니다. From a store? Or were they on someone's feet? Asked Squid. Neither. Stanley answered. They belonged to Clyde Livingston. Nobody believed him. No way, said Squid. 그건 클라이드 리빙스톤 거였어. 아무도 스탠리를 믿지 않았습니다. 설마. 스키드가 말했습니다. They belonged to Clyde Livingston. Nobody believed him. No way, said Squid. Clyde Livingston was a famous baseball player. He was the only player in history to ever hit four triples in one game. Clyde Livingston은 유명한 야구 선수였습니다. 그는 역사상 한 경기에서 네 개의 삼루타를 친 유일한 선수였습니다. Clyde Livingston was a famous baseball player. He was the only player in history to ever hit four triples in one game. Stanley had a poster of him hanging on the wall of his bedroom. 
It had been taken by the police and was used as evidence of his guilt in the courtroom. 스탠리의 방에는 그의 포스터가 걸려 있었습니다. 경찰은 그걸 가져갔고 법정에서 그의 유죄를 입증하는 증거로 사용되었습니다. Stanley had a poster of him hanging on the wall of his bedroom. It had been taken by the police and was used as evidence of his guilt in the courtroom. Clyde Livingstone also came to court. Clyde Livingstone도 법정에 나왔습니다. Clyde Livingstone also came to court. Clyde Livingstone testified that they were his sneakers and that he had donated them to help raise money for the homeless shelter. Clyde Livingstone은 그것은 그의 운동화이며 노숙자 보호소를 위한 모금을 돕기 위해 그것들을 기부했다고 증언했습니다. Clyde Livingstone testified that they were his sneakers and that he had donated them to help raise money for the homeless shelter. Back at school, a bully named Derek Dunn used to torment Stanley. 학교에서는 불량 학생 Derek Dunn이 Stanley를 괴롭히곤 했습니다. Back at school, a bully named Derek Dunn used to torment Stanley. The teachers never took Stanley's complaints seriously because Derek was so much smaller than Stanley. 선생님들은 결코 스탠리의 불평을 심각하게 받아들이지 않았습니다. 데릭이 스탠리보다 훨씬 작았기 때문입니다. The teachers never took Stanley's complaints seriously because Derek was so much smaller than Stanley. Some teachers even seemed to find it amusing that a little kid like Derek could pick on someone as big as Stanley. 몇몇 선생님들은 심지어 대릭과 같은 작은 아이가 스탠리만큼 큰 사람을 괴롭힐 수 있다는 것이 재미있다고 생각하는 것처럼 보였습니다. Some teachers even seemed to find it amusing that a little kid like Derek could pick on someone as big as Stanley. On the day Stanley was arrested, Derek had taken Stanley's notebook. And, after a long game of come and get it, finally dropped it in the toilet in the boys' restroom. Stanley가 체포되던 날, Derek은 Stanley의 공책을 가져갔고, 긴 게임 끝에 그것을 남자 화장실 변기에 버렸습니다. On the day Stanley was arrested, Derek had taken Stanley's notebook. And, after a long game of come and get it, finally dropped it in the toilet in the boys' restroom. By the time Stanley retrieved it, he had missed his bus and had to walk home. Stanley가 그것을 되찾았을 때, 그는 학교 버스를 놓쳤고 집까지 걸어가야 했습니다. By the time Stanley retrieved it, he had missed his bus and had to walk home. It was while he was walking home, carrying this wet notebook, with the prospect of having to copy the ruined pages, that the sneakers fell from the sky. 그 젖은 공책을 들고 집으로 걸어가는 동안, 망가진 페이지들을 복사해야 할것 같은 생각이 들었을 때쯤, 운동화가 하늘에서 떨어졌습니다. It was while he was walking home, carrying this wet notebook, with the prospect of having to copy the ruined pages, that the sneakers fell from the sky. They hadn't exactly fallen from the sky. He had just walked out from under a freeway overpass when the shoe hit him on the head. 신발은 정확히 하늘에서 떨어지지 않았습니다. 고속도로 고가도로 밑에서 그가 걸어 나왔을 때 신발이 그의 머리를 때렸습니다. They hadn't exactly fallen from the sky. He had just walked out from under a freeway overpass when the shoe hit him on the head. Naturally, he had no way of knowing they belonged to Clyde Livingston. 당연히 그는 그것이 클라이드 리빙스턴의 것이라는 걸알 방법이 없었습니다. Naturally, he had no way of knowing they belonged to Clyde Livingston. 
Stanley couldn't help but think that there was something special about the shoes, that they would somehow provide the key to his father's invention. 스탠리는 그 신발에 뭔가 특별한 것이 있다는 것, 그것들이 어떻게든 아버지의 발명의 열쇠를 제공할 것이라고 생각하지 않을 수 없었습니다. Stanley couldn't help but think that there was something special about the shoes, that they would somehow provide the key to his father's invention. It was too much a coincidence to be a mere accident. 그것은 단순한 사고가 되기에는 너무 많은 우연이었습니다. It was too much a coincidence to be a mere accident. Stanley had felt like he was holding destiny's shoes. 스탠리는 자신이 운명의 신발을 들고 있는 것처럼 느껴졌습니다. Stanley had felt like he was holding destiny's shoes. He ran. Thinking back now, he wasn't sure why he ran. 그는 달렸습니다. 지금 돌이켜 보면 그는 자신이 왜 뛰었는지 확신할 수 없었습니다. He ran. Thinking back now, he wasn't sure why he ran. Maybe he was in a hurry to bring the shoes to his father, or maybe he was trying to run away from his miserable and humiliating day at school. 아버지에게 신발을 가져다 주려고 서두른 것일 수도 있고, 학교에서의 비참하고 굴욕적인 나날에서 도망치려고 했던 것일 수도 있습니다. Maybe he was in a hurry to bring the shoes to his father, or maybe he was trying to run away from his miserable and humiliating day at school. A patrol car pulled alongside him. A policeman asked him why he was running. 순찰차가 그의 옆에 섰고 경찰관은 그에게 왜 달리고 있는지 물었습니다. A patrol car pulled alongside him. A policeman asked him why he was running. Shortly thereafter, Stanley was arrested. 그 직후 스탠리는 체포되었습니다. Shortly thereafter, Stanley was arrested. It turned out the sneakers had been stolen from a display at the homeless shelter. 노숙자 보호소의 전시품에서 운동화가 도난당한 것으로 드러났습니다. It turned out the sneakers had been stolen from a display at the homeless shelter. Clive Livingstone, who had once lived at the shelter when he was younger, was going to speak and sign autographs. 어릴 때 보호소에서 살았던 적이 있는 클라이드 리빙스턴이 연설을 하고 사인을 할 예정이었습니다. Clive Livingstone, who had once lived at the shelter when he was younger, was going to speak and sign autographs. His shoes would be auctioned, and it was expected that they would sell for over $5,000. 그의 신발은 경매에 붙여질 것이고, 5천 달러 이상에 팔릴 것으로 예상되었습니다. His shoes would be auctioned, and it was expected that they would sell for over $5,000. All the money would to help the homeless. 모든 돈은 노숙자들을 돕기 위해 쓸 것입니다. All the money would to help the homeless. Because of the baseball schedule, Stanley's trial was delayed several months. 야구 일정 때문에 스탠리의 재판은 몇달 연기되었습니다. Because of the baseball schedule, Stanley's trial was delayed several months. His parents couldn't afford a lawyer. 그의 부모님은 변호사를 선임할 여유가 없었습니다. His parents couldn't afford a lawyer. Stanley told the truth, but perhaps it would have been better if he had lied a little. Stanley는 진실을 말했지만 아마도 그가 약간의 거짓말을 했더라면 더 좋았을 것입니다. Stanley told the truth, but perhaps it would have been better if he had lied a little. No one believed they fell from the sky. 
아무도 신발이 하늘에서 떨어졌다고 믿지 않았습니다. No one believed they fell from the sky. The judge called Stanley's crime despicable. 판사는 스탠리의 범죄를 비열하다고 불렀습니다. The judge called Stanley's crime despicable. The shoes were valued at over $5,000. It was money that would provide food and shelter for the homeless. And you stole that from them, just so you could have a souvenir. 그 신발은 5천 달러 이상의 가치가 있고 그것은 노숙자들에게 음식과 거처를 제공할 돈입니다. 당신은 그것을 기념품처럼 훔쳤어요. The shoes were valued at over $5,000. It was money that would provide food and shelter for the homeless. And you stole that from them, just so you could have a souvenir. The judge said that there was an opening at Camp Green Lake, and he suggested that the discipline of the camp might improve Stanley's character. 판사는 그린레이크 캠프에 빈자리가 있다고 말했고, 캠프의 규율이 스탠리의 성격을 향상시킬 수 있다고 제안했습니다. The judge said that there was an opening at Camp Green Lake, and he suggested that the discipline of the camp might improve Stanley's character.